I'm going to show you everything I can stuff into the back of the Consolidated Outlands Nomad, and we're starting right now. That's what she said. <laughs> Thank you so much to all the support from patrons, channel members, and Twitch subscribers that make this possible. Welcome to A Star Citizen's Guide to the Galaxy. What's up, citizens? This is Subliminal here, and in this guide, I'm going to show you what types of vehicles and quantities of them I can fit into the back of the Consolidated Outland Nomad. We'll be trying out everything from small to large vehicles to even light fighters and snubs. And before you say you can't fit a snub in the back of the Nomad, shut your face and just watch the video, all right? Let's get to it. All right, let's uh, let's see how many Grey Cat PTVs we can get in the back of here. Thank you, and please visit again. This should be simple. I'm guessing four is likely. Let's get the last one in. Oh. Uh-oh, I could have done that a little bit better. All right, but they seem to be in there. Let's see if we can close the ramp. Oh no, we broke the ramp. Um, all right, I should be able to fly off with it like this. Let's head to the cockpit. Oh, 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 oh. <gasps> Mistakes were made. All right, if you were wondering why in my MSR video, I wasn't messing around with bikes, this is why, because their physics suck. All right, we got those two in there pretty good. Let's see if we can get this third one in. Oh, no, no. All right, let's drop it. Oh, no. Okay, that seems good. Get out of there. Oh, they're kind of bouncing around. Oh, no. All right, th they should settle. Go ahead and close up the cargo bay. Oh. Oh, oh, they're going to go boom. They didn't go boom. Uh, oh, rip. All right, let's try and take them for a spin while they're back there rattling around. All right. It seems like getting two in there is practical. But adding the third one just causes like way too much instability. Of course, gravity is not a problem. All right, let's see if we can get a cyclone in there. Of course, you can get a cyclone in there, but we can't stop here at Subliminal's channel with just one cyclone. We got to do it like they do on the Discovery channel and try and get two of them in there. Oh, oh, I mean, this works. We could definitely probably get both of these out at some point. What? Uh oh, uh oh. Oh, oh no. <gasps> I think we broke the game. <gasps> it is all a simulation. All right, here's the rock. Uh, I'm not going to try and get two of these in there, but uh, let's just get this thing to fly around, see if it's stable. I've been getting word from a lot of you guys that it's not stable. Uh, what I've done here is I've backed it in and I turned the power off and it uh, it runs stable. You can fly it around with no problems. Of course, I'm in the seat, though, and I've heard some people say that uh, maybe that's the reason why it's stable. So I'm going to go ahead and hop out and we'll see how that works. Again, it's powered off and it's just chilling in the back of the Nomad. So let's take off and see. It's still stable. Uh, you can see the force reactions are affecting me, but not the rock. So, all right, let's try for the, the Ursa Rover. Oof. Ah, it's just not, uh, not wide enough. Let's get some more speed, see if we can ram it in there. Yes. That, that looks like it could work. Let's close the cargo bay door. Oh, 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 I think, I think we've got it. I think we've got it. I don't know if this is stable. Let's, uh, let's take off, see what we can do. 
Oh. Oh no. All right, all right. That is definitely worth another shot. Let's try and make it so that we can like lower the, there we go. Lower the Nomad, get it lower. All right, that is in there, boys. That is in there like swimwear. Oh, oh, are we, are we good? I think, I think we're good. I think we're in there. Yep. And we're stable. Let's do a couple flybys with it to make sure. Oh, it is really bugging out. Look at that. All right, you know what, boys? We gotta go for it. Let's try and drop it into the 890. We can do it, we can do it. Yes, let's go. All right, now look, I know this isn't gonna fit, but if I don't try, the people in the comments are gonna riot. So let's, let's do the best we can. I think it might be possible to get this to work. Let's try and back the Nomad up to scoop it in. That could work. This could work. If we could pinch the door shut, pinch it in there with the... Oh, yeah, no, that's not gonna work. Let's move on. All right, what do we got now? We've got the P-52. Let's try nose first. I don't think this is gonna work. All right, let's try and back it in. Pop it in. Let's go. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, no. At least it was just me that died. Oh, oh, man. All right. Let's try it in zero G this time. If I can get the wings to go on top of those little things that stick out, I think we have a shot. There we go. All right. Oh, engine's off. And is that stable? Oh, no, we're floating out. All right, let's try it again. Darn canopy bug. Canopy gets in the way. Let's try and tuck it into this little hole here. I think, I think that could work. Let's try and close the ramp up now. Oh, 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 oh. I think, I think that's good. Let's try and fly away. All right, let's try to turn the engines off so we can get that smoke to go away. Oh, oh. Attention. All right, we're still stable. I have been to scan your Come for on. Please hold your vehicle and stand by. 20 minutes later. Oh, we can QT? <gasps> no way. All right, this is awesome. Whoa, whoa, whoa. All right, I think we're good. Try and head back down towards the planet, see if we can, if it'll fall out. I think it's in there. Pretty good. Looks like the canopy bug is no longer holding it in. The open canopy is not holding it anymore. All right, let's try and QT, all right? But this time, I'm going to jump out. <gasps> so that's how that works. Oh, shit. I don't have a quantum drive. All right, here we go. Let's do the M50. Nose in first. Ah, uh, I don't think this is going to work. The wheels are on the landing pad. Yeah. Oh, oh. 
Ooh. Um, I think, I think it's a go. We are in there. Look at that. All right, this works out fine. Let's turn it around and try it backwards. Again, I should be able to just set the wings on top of those two arms. And I think we're good to go. This is, yeah. I think that works. Let's close up the door. Oh, oh. Took a little bit of damage there to the Nomad, but I think, oh wow, that's a, that's a good fit. That's in there real good. I might not be able to get back out. That's what she said. <laughs> of course, gravity is no issue. Let's take it through its paces a little bit. Oh, it would be so cool to fire a missile from here. Let's disengage. <gasps> Let's go, boys. Let's go. All right, next, let's try the Misk Razor. Now, I'm pretty sure it's not going to be able to fit with those wings, but I'm going to try it anyway. Oh, oh, all right. Well, I didn't need those anyway. This might actually be pretty good. Try and back it in without it. Oh, oh. Should be able to just roll over. Oh, it's so hard to roll when you're looking at the camera backwards. All right, that's good. Let's set her down. Oh, let's redo it. Coming from this top angle, it seems to work out pretty good. Oh, oh. All right. I think the razor is uh, pretty fragile. Try it again. I'm gonna keep the wings up as long as I can this time. That might keep it more stable. Um, we're in there kind of crooked, but that might be it. It might be good. All right, and the cargo elevator is still up. Probably broken and stuck that way. We got it. Nice. Without breaking it either. And let's disengage. <laughs> oh man, this is great. I love this game. All right, so people are gonna ask, let's try the arrow. Close the door. This might actually work. Oh, 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 the legs came out. Yeah, I don't know if this is gonna work with those wing tips on. Let's try nose first without with, with the landing gear still um, up. I don't know that this is going to be enough room. No, no, this is going to work. Let's try and back it in. If we can get those wings to kind of catch on that top lip. I don't think this is going to work either. Nope. All right. Nose in this time with the landing gear down. That's, yeah, no, that's definitely not going to work. Oh, we broke the wingtips. <gasps> no. Oh, God. All right. Can't be complete without an MPUV. Let's try this stubby little sucker. Oh, you know, this might actually work. Let's hop inside. <gasps> uh oh. Oh. Try it again. We get up. Oh, that's um. I think this might be a winner. Oh oh. Oh no! It fell out. I just think its center of gravity isn't set up for this. Let's try and back it in. Okay, this could work too if we can pinch it in there with the loading ramp. Oh, 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 no. All right, let's try and flip him back over. Let's let's put it in there. Nose first again. Oh, 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 uh oh, somebody's going to die. <gasps> Poor guy. 
Poor guy. If you enjoy my channel, there are so many ways to support it. I go live on Twitch just before almost every YouTube release, and I'd love to see you there. There's also free options like Prime Gaming subscriptions and sending out for UEC in the verse because reviewing ships is expensive. There are also sub club subscriptions, merch, and more generous forms of support. Head over to subliminalschannel.tv to learn how. Your support in all forms makes this channel possible. Even your viewership, liking, and subscribing goes a long way. To continue watching, here's a video I think you may like. Here's a video YouTube thinks you may like. And until next time, citizens, I'll see you in the verse.